everybody and welcome to another episode of Jurassic World the game just before uh, the big Omega blah, 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 runs out we have about uh, alpha it's like well alpha of six we have less than God knows not not very long we need to get this up to level nine so how about we put in uh, I've used everything oh no oh this is no good technical difficulties and uh who else we need something that's just regular a regular is, is that good if we just have interrupt do you think we can get to level 10 in one go should we give it a shot guys so not only are we taking on alpha 06 oh look at it there oh that looks so cool oh god i sped it up by accident oh, oh, what's the time we need to turn on the other one so i can actually see i don't have a watch you see that's the problem I got nothing on me wrist. Um, so we are not only going to take on Alpha 06, but we're also going to be getting the rewards for the uh, Glyphalith. Is it Gyra? The, the crocodile one. That's the one. Uh, also, I want to talk a little bit about the uh, the thing that happened with uh, Ludia because we had um, we had a uh, in the last video, if you remember right, I was like. Is Jurassic World the game closing down? <gasps> we need we need shock horror. Yeah, that one. <laughs> okay, let's try and take this guy out. Uh, we'll give ourselves three. But not only are we taking on the Alpha Row Six, doing the tournament thing, but also oh look at it go! Oh, it looks so cool! Yes, defeating Alpha Row Six, which is impossible. But we are joined. This is a collaboration with another content creator out there in the in the, the social social sphere. I'm very, very happy to introduce the one, the only Ruahuha, which you can find on uh, on Instagram. <laughs> Isn't that right? Yeah, I'm looking after him today. He's not my dog. But uh, this is what I've got to do. You're with me, and we've got to work today. So this is bring your child to work. Yes, yes it is. You see how he's looking over there? He's looking over there at the door. <laughs> he's like, please save me. You're mine. <laughs> Are you okay? You okay being like this? You've got my, my headphone cable is wrapped around you. Is that better? You can... That, like that? Is that okay? You put your head on? Okay, you can stay down there. Sorry, he's kind of out of shot. I was thinking, oh, I'll get a cute dog in the video. That'll get the views. And yeah, I can, I can just see the top of your ear. Oh, you got something on your ear. Oh, there you go. <laughs> so, I think there's definitely some uh, some super DNA that we can get from this. If, if I remember right. Uh, I think there's one for like doing getting it to level four and then getting it to level eight or something, so. And I'm really not paying attention <laughs> to this, but, uh, cause I'm not too worried. The only thing I'm worried about is time because we've only got so long before this event goes and then the super DNA is gone. But we have, oh God, we got a seven. We got a seven. Whoa, oh, that looks so cool. I love this thing. It looks awesome. In comes the Indoraptor. Right. You ready? We're gonna get to level 10. I'm gonna do that. I think, yeah, I think yeah, it was seven attack, right? So the max it would have had is one, one block, I think. Uh, also, audio, I know we're getting there. We're getting close. We're getting close to the perfect audio. <laughs> Taken weeks to get back to where we were. Uh, but hell, last here we are. You're right there, Ruth. You're right. Uh, so one, two, kills and factor in two, and then two block. Oh, perfect. Look at that. Ah, how far can we get level 10 in one round? And then, I mean, if you want to, there's loads of, um, oh, that's a nice color scheme, actually. If you had that color scheme for some Tyranids or something, that would look great. I'm like, ooh, I like that. Oh, no, I think he's killed me. I think he got me. Yeah, he did. Well, we got level seven, hopefully. Oh, that looks so cool. I love, oh my, it's so cool. Okay, so we did 76,000 damage. Um, I think we've still got some time left. So we used one legendary. 
Uh, we used one carnival, and we definitely did over 500 damage, which is really what you want to go for. You just want to get those missions, because they give you the most DNA. Don't they, Boo? Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Um, now, how, how much longer do we have on this event? Uh, also, what is a super DNA? So we need to reach level 10 and complete 10 raid missions. Now, we only have 8 minutes, so we're not going to get... Uh, two rare creatures, five legend. We're, we're not going to get that, but we can get it to level 10. Uh, so in this case, I think the best thing for us to do... I mean, it's it's probably better go for Tijongasaurus, then an Indoraptor, and then maybe even a Tijongasaurus? Because what we could probably do is, um, is just go for reserve, and it might... It'll just probably just kill us instantly. Which I'm not too fussed about. Should have a Rue camp. If we do live stream, would you want a Roo cam? A Roo hoo ha? Roo hoo. What's your at? What's your at, Roo? What is your at? Huh? I don't even know what your at is. I'll link him down in the description below if you do want to follow his escapades. <laughs> uh, so I think it went for two. Right, so we can take. That's level eight sword. Then we can switch in the, the other Tijongasaurus. That's level nine sorted. And then it's just a matter of just going all out, I think. Oh, do you remember when they first put this in? I remember. Well, I remember when they first put in the, the, the boss battles. I was in America at the time. Uh, so we're going to switch out. And I remember climbing. Uh, it was somewhere in LA. It's like, it's it's very popular with runners and stuff like that. And we went there. I was like, this would be great. I'll just record here. <laughs> Always got one block. Goes for the bite. Right, come on. Come on, Interruptor. We got this. We got this. We're gonna go. Wait, I have to go for three. That guarantees us. And then I'm gonna go for three block, just in case he didn't block, which he didn't. So we can only go for two attacks to kill us. So that's level nine sword. We got this. We got this, Rue. We got this. Would you sit on my shoulder? Because if you were on my shoulder, that would work. I'd have to hold your bum though. I can't do that. Oh, I did go for it. <laughs> That one block I did made all the difference there. Wow. Wow. So now we just go for an all-out attack. And there we go. Level 10. Look at that. Uh, also, I do want to just double-check before this ends <laughs> that we have gotten... Um, what do you call it? Uh, the Gryfo... Griffelith. No, that's the hybrid. Gryposuchus. That's it. Um, I just want to double-check that we have got that. Uh, sorted. Because I I think I was rank... Oh, level 90, 97th in Dominator League. So I just want to double check that we have got that. So, uh, I will also mention about this whole closing of the game, the Chinese thing as well, and what what really is going on there. Uh, oh, we're on five missions. Ooh, is it possible? Is it possible? Hold on, I just want to double check. because we've Oh, we got five minutes. I think we can do it, guys. So five minutes. I, am, I think we, that's it, right? We're not going to fall down anymore, right? With five minutes to spare, it's not going to happen, right? It's not going to happen. It's, it's okay. It's okay, right? Okay. That's, I'm hoping that's, we're okay. We're okay. We're going to continue doing this. So we need to use one more legendary creature, two rares. Okay, so we're going to do the same tactic as we did before, except for this time, we're going to use rares. Uh, so one, two, three. We're going to switch out the Tapijarosaurus for a Urlifosaurus. Because actually, you know what? It needs to be a legendary creature. And we need to do 3,000 damage. So, I mean, a Rajasteg is enough. And that's done one, two, three missions, taking us to eight. And then we need to do one more battle after this. Ah, oh, look how good that looks. Oh, it's so good. Uh, so we go for one reserve. Oh, look at it, Giga. It's a weird model for a Giga. Definitely. I wonder who okayed that. I mean, obviously, Universal okayed that, I'm assuming. So, Rajasteka comes in. All we need to do is 3,000 worth of damage. And there you go. That's it done. Seems a shame that, you know, we wasted Rajasteka just for that. But, remember, it's super DNA. And we need super DNA. Because we're working towards... Um, what's it called? Uh, Interrupted Gen 2. And... There's another one. There's the other hybrid that we're going for. Oh my god, he actually did it. Okay, he did some more damage. Should we get him to level 12? <laughs> it's probably killed him again. What about sit your butt that back down? It's actually not good because we're running out of time and we really need to get this. 
So hopefully, I mean, the max bucks we can get from the uh, Gryposaurus tournament is, what, 4,500. So that would be good. Also, with the trades, I found a sneaky way of getting loads of VIP points. The books is, like, not guaranteed, but the VIP points are. Um, I guess if you fidel- Can you trade things for books if you're a fidelity member? Because that would be good. Ooh. I might try it. I might test out this theory. Because we could get- If we do one month of fidelity membership, we could get so many books. So many bugs. I'm, I'm tempted. I'm tempted to see if that makes a difference. Okay, so we did... Uh, we did the legendary. Uh, we did two rares. We did the 3,000 damage, which gives us 300 DNA, which is good. Uh, I think we are two missions away. So 5,000 damage and three herbivores. So 5,000 damage. So one, two, three. Uh, there... Th we should tell you what. We'll use this guy. So we need to do 5,000 damage. Uh, Mono Stegatops is probably going to be the best one. So, here we go. Let's give it a shot. Tajongosaurus. I'm just going to go for reserves, and then I'm going to go reserves on that. And then hopefully, Mono Stegatops can just come in and do as much damage as possible. Remember, it doesn't matter how much health Alpha 06 has. As long as you just do that amount of damage. It doesn't matter how much damage you do to it, but the total you would have done it if it had, like, unlimited health. So, yeah, this is awesome. So we're going to be on, like, eight. And that's definitely over 5,000. So that's two more missions. And there you go. Within ten minutes, we've done all of the missions of the uh, the Alpha 06. Uh, we're going to get so many super DNA here, guys. It's going to be awesome. So, for whatever reason, he doesn't want to attack us. So that's something. Go on, go for eight. You go for five, you kill us. Oh, I guess you could go for the minimum amount needed. Fair enough. Whatever. Here it is. 900. So we can go for... He's going to have three blocks. So one, two, three, four, five. There's 8,000 damage. Even if he blocks for... Which he didn't. Oh, Monost I've never seen Monostegatops in this lighting. He's very shiny. Wow. Beautiful. Killed it. But unfortunately, it's about to get back up and kill you. But you did your... You served your purpose. So... Oh... I've, it's been crazy. I've, I've been doing the events. I've done this boss battle. We've done the tournament as well. Hours. Hours this has taken. I, I do want to check that fidelity, though. I do want to check the fidelity trick. Because there's there's some there's a way that you can get loads of VIP points in this with the custom trays. Um, so, yeah, we got that. That's nine. And there you go. That's ten. And there, yeah, has it. How many, how many minutes do we have? We have just seconds left. And we're still, oh, we're still left, we're still left. And I think, have we, have we done it? Have we done this one? Yeah, there you go, reach level. Look at all that. Oh my God, that's so much. That is so much. Okay, in about 20 seconds, Rue, we're going to, uh, we're going to unlock it, I think. Oh, let's watch. 14, 13, 12. And uh, we got that to do. So what is clocking? We got <laughs> that was super hard. Look at those battles. Like, yeah, I'm not doing that one. Because it's one pterosaur, two pterosaurs, and then the last battle will be three pterosaurs. Two! One! Are you ready? When we click exit, we're about to get it. Bang! There it is! We did it! Gripo sutures done and done. We finished top 1%. Fingers crossed. Rue, can you cross your paws? Can you cross your paws? Can you cross the paws? Can you cross your paws? Look at that. He's so good. <laughs> okay, come on. 4,500. Oh, wait, no, it's 500 each. I thought it was 1,500. Oh, well. You can, you can go back to sleep now. <laughs> so we got 1,000 bucks, though. That's loads. Get in. Probably reimburses me for all the entries I had to do, which is like five each time. So Griper Suit just unlocked and Wait, what? What do you mean? You've earned zero loyalty points. I guess we get zero loyalty points then, eh? That's good. Get in. So instead of getting like 2,600 loyalty points, we got zero. Got zero. 
That would, that, and my VIP, bo my bonus, you know, the, the doubles it, that I pay real money for. Zero. Zero. <laughs> God damn it, Ludia, man. What's wrong with you? Oh. oh, right, okay. Well, either way, we can instantly hatch it for, I think it's, I think it does still cost bucks though to do that. So I should have just done it there, shouldn't I? Amphibians. Let's find it. So, Griper Sutures. So, at level 40, yeah, again, stay Presser Sutures. Now, of course, Presser Sutures has got me better because VIP creatures are better than tournaments. Uh, yeah, by a lot. By a lot. It's got like an extra 1,400 health and an extra 700. Are you tired? Are you yawning, Petal? Oh, it's a cutie. Oh, it's a cutie. Um, yeah, it's not as good. So, we're going to speed that up. Uh, activate a regular incubator or instant incubator for 250. Wait. <laughs> it's still costing me 250 bucks to do the instant hatchery? That's not right, man. Ludia, what are you doing? I've paid you for like seven or eight months, right? To get this building. It should then not cost me extra bucks to put something in it. Come on, get rid of that. Get away with that. There's no need for that. I want to. I want to just double check to see if that did cost me bucks or if that's a mess up. So there it is, Gripo Sutures, looking gorgeous, and that did actually cost me 250 bucks because now I'm on 15,000 instead of 15,258. Uh, so we'll place that down. Whoa! Yay! Let's feed it, shall we? Nom noms. Nom nom nom. Ah, uh, first it was in Jurassic World Alive, and we're seeing a lot of dinosaurs come back doing a reverse. We've got Tarbosaurus, and now we've got Gripo. Uh, so we'll claim our free food, I suppose. Uh, Gripo Sutures resembles the modern-day Gariel, a Piscovorus uh, crocodile with a remarkably long body and a narrow snout, meant for catching fish. Oh, <laughs> So, that's kind of sucky that not only do I have to wait a week to put something in, but depending on how long um, it takes, the book price of speeding it up also goes up. Well, there you go. There's 30 books, I suppose, helping. Oh, look, we got 30 times as many VIP points as we did in the free pack as we did in the freaking Griper Sutures pack. <laughs> God damn it, Ludia man, what are you playing at? How could you make a mistake like that? But now we have, oh my God, whoa, whoa. So that is 50, 75, uh, 6, 85, 95, 111 super rare DNA. So let's just collect all that, shall we? Bump that up. Oh yes, go, just look at it. <laughs> so we now have a thousand dimetrodon DNA. So I don't know what we need for this. Uh, no! Oh, I didn't mean to click the advert, damn it! Oh, we just got regular DNA. After all that, I just got regular DNA. Didn't even get anything special. Brilliant! <laughs> God damn it. Land dinosaurs 10% off in the market? <gasps> I'm assuming that's because, um, okay, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna put something easy in, and let's have a look at the Gripo Sutures. So it should, we should save some money on this. Uh, so 10%, so normally it's 7,400, now it's 6,600. So there you go, 10 bucks. So I could instantly get it for 1,600 bucks, but what I could also do is do the instant hatchery and get it for 250 that or i have to wait a week a week oh that's horrible right but what i will do is i will wait a week um because i am saving uh dna on getting it uh uh no 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 i don't know what i bought there i i went amphibian and i did that and i don't know i hope they didn't buy an osteposaurus uh 50 bucks for that Fine with that. So there's a three more. So that'll take us to a level 30 once these all hatch. Because we've already got a level 10 there. 
So, is there anything extra? So, we can get it from the DNA building. Slowly getting up there. We've got the instant fuse as well. We've also got the instant uh, buyback. Uh, oh, there you go. Collect for another five yeah, the thingy points. So, what do we need for the Demetrodon? Hold on, hold on. If I go in here and I go on to super hybrids, uh, here it is. I need... Oh, wow, that's a weird number. 1,700, really? It is a Carnoraptor. The Carnoraptor is so good. I don't want to lose it, but I think I might have to. Because I'm sure that this hybrid is going to be way better. All right, all right. Uh, so what do we have? So we may as well collect from that now, eh? So we spent the food. Uh, what else we got? We've got a battle for survival. And we've also got beasts of the biodome. And unfortunately, at the moment, we don't have any Clash of the Titans, so it's not going towards anything. Uh, I might as well do the battle for the survival because even though I technically do need food at this moment, in a while, I won't. Oh, look, I got my hair. Oh, lovely. <laughs> uh, so we'll just we'll just do the... Yeah, and the fact is, this one is also free, so it really doesn't cost me anything. And we'll also speed it up, so it doesn't even cost us time. <laughs> Yes, so, so sorry, I meant to mention this. China, yes. Um, we had in the last video, I put up that picture uh, that was sent to Vertigo, which, uh, who then sent it to me, saying that on January or February, it was next year, Jurassic World, the game is closing. Now, this only applies to China. Um, I, and that's what I speculated. I assumed that because they were Chinese and they got this, that it was only China. And the whole, you know, everything that's going on with China at the moment, I thought it, it's highly likely that it is China. Now, the interesting thing is, um, there is a big player base for this game and just generally video games in China. So you might be thinking, why are they cancelling it? Why why are they stopping it, this game being supported in China? And that is a question that I posed to Ludia. Uh, which I got a, uh, a vague answer. Uh, <laughs> basically, uh, they pointed me towards an article. Um, and it was about... Um, if you don't know, China's uh, introducing a new law um, that basically a lot of companies that want to do business in China have to abide by. Um, and I don't know the whole ins and outs of this law, but basically uh, it means that anybody, any game developer that has a video game in China um, has to basically be compliant with the government. So imagine if in America, uh, Trump had a say, or the president, or whoever, the president of the of the United States, had a say on what video games, or uh, what the game developers could and could not put in the game. That's what this rule is for China. So the Chinese government gets to, well, basically tell the game developers what they can and cannot put in the video game. Um, and of course, understandably, a lot of game developers don't like that. <laughs> Um, because it's, you know, they can put whatever they want, it's their game. So a lot of, um, a lot of games are being pulled from the Apple Store. Um, and this, of course, Jurassic World the Game will be one of them. Uh, which is such a shame because, you know, it's not the people, it's like the person who sent this image. They want to play the game. They have nothing to say with this whole rule, this whole law that's being implemented. Um... But they will now no longer be able to play Jurassic World the game. Uh, maybe there's proxies. Maybe you can get around it through that way. So I'm sorry that it's happening. Uh, it's just a shame. But that was the answer that I got from it. Um, so nothing that can be done, unfortunately. You, you may be able to continue it if you maybe switch your profile over to like a, an Australian or a different kind of uh, region, maybe. Uh, oh yeah, also, there you go. More of that and more for another super red. <laughs> oh, we got so much. We are close to an Indoraptor Gen 2. We are, however, close to getting two Indoraptors. I feel like I need an Interrupted Gen 2. Just to say I've got an Interrupted Gen 2, but as far as usability goes, I would rather have... Hey, uh, hello, what you looking at me for? Eh? Um, 
<laughs> so cute, aren't you? Such a cutie. Um, there is uh, something to be said for having two interrupters because Interrupt Gen 2 is better than an interrupter, but not by much. You're stretching. Are you stretching? Um, so yeah, that is gonna have to wrap this video. Sorry, I thought we'd get more cuties. I thought I thought you'd be more in shot, you. But uh, you're not. So there you go. Say hello to the beautiful people. Hello. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, if you enjoyed this video, guys, uh, leave a like. Um, we will, of course, cover anything new that comes out of the game. So we've done a lot, actually. It's been a short video, but we've covered a lot. We've talked about a lot, uh, as well as Jurassic World, the game is staying open. And I thought it would because of um, all of the... Do you, do you lie like a baby? Do you still do that? Do you lie like a little baby? What are you doing? He's <laughs> like, no. There you go. How about that? You can have the headphone cables around you. <laughs> uh, so yeah, there's um, the game will stay open in regular play stores. Um, it's just a shame that it's closing in China. The game again is still updating. I, I mean, I would when you look at the VIP and you see all of these buildings and all the events. So month seven is when I got that one. So you got month eight, month nine, month ten. I was like, there's no way that this game's closing. Why would they do that? Um, so what about the VIP? This, actually, before we go, this is something interesting. Uh, oh, it's gone. I thought it would still be on offer. So the, there's this, right? If you want books, you can have this pack for 500, right? Or you can open up the solid gold pack and you only get 100. So technically, if you're after books, the Brontotherium is better. Now you could even open the Procoptodon and get 1,500 books. Um, now in my head, you're, you're kind of better doing the Procoptodon because there's more chance of you getting 3,000 books by opening one of these packs than getting 3,000 books by opening this one because you need to get the equivalent. You need to get every card for two packs needs to be books. And then if you do get that, you save 10,000, but it's very low. It, you may even open two of these packs and not get a single book because there's nothing guaranteed. But with Procoptodon, you're 50% chance of getting that. And then 50% chance. So you've got a good 50% chance. And then the third one's 25%. So, I don't know. I don't know. Is this, that's what you're named after, a kangaroo Did you know that? Who am I? <laughs> But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video, uh, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs>